Hey folks, just got my order in from from FishingTackleOutlet.net. Don't know if y'all have ever made any purchases or checked out their website, but they they carry a lot of name brand baits for super cheap prices. I'm talking a lot of times half of the price as your other retailers. Go ahead and open this up here and show you what I got. And let you know some of the prices so you see for yourself how good a deal it is. There we go. Got that bad boy open. All right. See, so of course, the, get your invoice with it here. Let's see. First thing I picked up here was some uh, mini split shot pliers. Good for uh, changing hooks out and so forth. You know, they're small there, but these were actually only 99 cents. I don't know how sturdy they are, but 99 cents doesn't really matter, I don't guess. All right. Next thing I got here is I picked up some quarter ounce jig heads, a couple different colors. Let me show you all what these look like though. As you can see, they, they're supposed to look like the head of a bait fish. These are, I got these mainly for swim bait or grub fishing because I actually like to snip the head of the swim bait off and put on here and let this act as the head to it. Works pretty good, looks somewhat realistic. As you can see, I picked them up in the, they call this color Cajun Croaker. But these were actually only 99 cents a three pack also, which is really good for jig heads. Let's see, the other color I picked up here is green olive. I figured it'd go fairly well with green pumpkin, watermelon seed, watermelon, colors like that. There's the, that's the green olive ones there, quarter ounce also. Like I said, all these were 99 cents per three pack. Let's see. I also picked up this color here, what they call natural blue. This one is a little different colored than what I saw on the computer, but I think it'll work fine. That's the natural blue that they're calling there. But yeah, these are killer, especially for 99 cents. Seems like they got good, solid, sharp hooks. Always a bonus. Alright. As you can see, I picked up picked up all kinds of them because at that price, couldn't turn it down. Let's see. I also picked up picked up some of the uh, wave worms, tiki finesse worms. This is the watermelon seed color. It's actually a 15 pack and I picked these up for 99 cents. I've used these before and I know they work real well because they they produce rock bass and smallmouth for me all the time out of the creek. Usually just, usually I'll just wacky rig these, throw them weightless on an ultralight rod. It's a blast once you hook into one on them little bitty rods. Let's see. I also picked up the Wave Worms Tiki Ribbon Tail. These are the 10 inch, they're actually in Plum Candy Fleck. And it's a it's a 10 pack there. And these were also 99 cents. Let's see, I picked up these are called Zeal Straight Worms. I've actually never fished with these before. Never even seen them before, I think. I think they're mainly sold in Japan, from what I take. 
but as you can see they actually they actually favor a little small minnow or a fry of some sort they look awesome they're, they're made specifically to be used on a drop shot but I'd say you could nose hook them too and use a split shot rig either way but I picked these up in the, in the three inch in smoke with black and purple flake is this one and I also picked up the same thing in three inch watermelon there's a little better picture right there but yeah as you can see they're made by culprit oh no look like they'll do good I'll I'll put them in another video I do and we'll see just how well they do. Let's see, I also picked up here, these are uh, Culprit Fat Maxes. They're in the 9 inch and that they are, let's see, Tequila Shad is the coloration here. I'll show you one of these. These are actually sure you've heard of throwing big worms especially in the heat of the summer but these are a much larger profile Let's see if I can get this open leaked a little on the way and it's oily as all get out oh yeah as you can see this has a much larger body and it's flat on the bottom unlike most worms i think where it's larger and flat it'll slow the rate of descent i think it'll actually want to run a little higher and it's got it's got enough weight to it where you can actually fish it weightless if you want especially you fish a weightless and texas rig it with a extra wide gap offset hook and actually drag this across the top of the vegetation mats on the lake or or lily pads whatever whatever is in the area you're fishing but yeah never tried these before but it's one of my favorite colors i love tequila sunrise or tequila shad as they call it i believe these will probably be a good producer all right also i picked up a picked up a bobber here as you can as you can see but it's not a regular bobber this is actually made for salt water and everything oh sorry about that uh, I paid a dollar 49 for these but yeah what we have here is they're made for salt water it's a uh, as you can see it slides back and forth and it has the the beads on there this is actually they fish them for redfish a lot, but it's a it's a popping cork is what they call it. I don't know if you'll be able to hear it here, but it makes a sound similar to like a popper does on the top of the water. I've never actually tried this before, but I was thinking that I can rig this up and use a short leader off this side, maybe maybe six to eight inches, and put. A, a small to medium sized swim bait on there and actually be just barely subsurface but still get the pop that you do from a traditional popper. Don't know, like I say, I've never tried it before, but I will most definitely let you all know if this works out. But yeah, that was that was also only 99 cents. Okay, now, what we have here, I also picked up a Rapala X-Rap Shad. Here, it's a, uh, it's a very good bait. It's made by Rapala. It's in the size 8. Uh, one of my favorite jerk baits. I don't know, I really like the X-Rap. It's just a multitude of different ways you can fish it, and it's totally different between fishing it super fast or really running it slow for your cold water bite. It's, it's a great lure. I suggest you all get some if you can. But I only paid 
$4.98 for this. These normally sell for around $8. So, you can see that was an excellent savings. But, last but most definitely not least, I've been wanting one of these forever. But, they're normally like $20 when you go to try and get one. Let me pull it out of the box here. But, it's a River to Sea Whopper Plopper. I actually picked up the 90 size. They make, they make two bigger sizes. I think a 130 and a 190. But, I wanted to try this one out first. I've heard nothing but good things about them. But, like I say, I've never thrown one myself. As you can see there, it's, uh, it's tail here rotates, much like a traditional buzz bait. This will rotate and draw, and draw through the water, leaving a, a bubble trail and very, very strong vibrations. But the front is shaped similar to uh, Zara Spook or, or other top water walk the dog baits. Don't know, haven't ever fished one heard loads of great things I'll definitely let you all know on this one but like I was saying most places you go to buy one of these it's going to be close to $20 if not I actually picked it up for $10.49 which is an excellent deal like I say if you all haven't checked out fishingtackleoutlet.net I definitely give it a look they have a, a lot of name brand baits for super cheap. I, I make a lot of purchases from them. They're, they're good about shipping out quick. And they send quality bait. So, not sponsored by them or anything, but I just wanted to pass the word on to you guys about the savings. Well, thanks for watching. Appreciate it. We'll see y'all again.